hello guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel and you love what you see hit on that subscribe button okay and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so each time i post a video you'll be the first to know okay so let's go ahead and start this video so this is a video that i did like during the quarantine period okay and honestly i've just been so busy that i've not really had time to like work on the video edit the video and all that stuff you can tell like the big difference between the video of today and you know what i mean the quarantine video but i was just like let me just go ahead and edit this video today since i got time and just put this up there okay so let me show you guys what it looks like after i took the rock off the floor okay the floor really don't look that perfect i'm not gonna say the work is completely done but for the main time okay since things are not yet settled i'm gonna use the floor like this until i'm able to decide like, okay do i want to change the floor do i want to leave it like this yeah i know how it is right now okay you can't get nobody to come by your house and do some work so you have to do the work by yourself so in today's video i'm going to show you guys how i'm going to use just this in my knife probably with the scissors to get my carpet off my floor okay so i can understand so my daughter got like spilled a whole bunch of stuff on my carpet and i just can't stand it anymore and i can't get nobody to come by my house right now to do so i figured i could do it by myself all i did i used this to like take out the nails on the little pins on the floor and whole room is kind of junky right now because i really can't i don't want to get like everything out of the room like the dresser the bed or nothing like that i want to do it and still leave everything like in place even though i'm kind of like pushing stuff on the side but i still want to be able to like do stuff without having to like move everything out of my room so i'm using this knife right here it is so sharp all i do like that's what my daughter does so all i do basically i'm going to show you guys like because i don't want to remove the dresser this is the dresser right here all i'm going to do is like i'm going to use this knife okay <laughs> make it cheap okay so i'm going to cut this part right here okay because i don't want to take like the whole thing out so i'm just going to cut oh there's a little nail right here i'm just going to cut this little part right here I already cut it like this and remove this section now so I'm, I'm removing it like section by section then I'm gonna move the dresser a little bit further then I'm gonna remove this other section so so that's what I did on this part right here if you can see on the floor this we already removed that section so I'm re removing like little bit at a time okay I don't want to remove my bed I don't want to remove no dresser or remove things around it's kind of crazy right here okay just bear with me i'm going to show you guys when all this job is done so that's what the floor looks like after i remove the first portion so this is the second portion i'm removing right here okay that's gone and that is gone okay so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to remove this do it yourself make it cheap okay it's a new season so do it yourself save some money but just be careful okay you don't want to hurt yourself okay and like i said i didn't feel like going out to get any other kind of like equipment so that's why i'm using this it's my knife so now you got like little pins and little nails on the floor I'm gonna have to figure out a way that I can take ooh, that I can take this piece of wood out right here. But for now, you got like little pins. You got like little pins on the floor. And all I'm doing, that is what the pins look like. So I, all I'm doing is like just looking for those little pins. Like this is another one right here, and I just take that out. So 
sometimes they're kind of hard to pick up but it takes a little time but you know it's worth it but that is like the before they ask the before i'm going to show you guys like when i'm done with like everything i'm able to take like the whole packet out then i'm going to show you guys what it looks like after that. So this is what the floor looks like after I took the carpet down or yeah after I took the carpet down and if you look by the left hand side you see that's a cable passing through there I just put a little tape right there because I got a little girl that's like she gets into everything so I don't know but I feel like it looks so much better without the carpet on the floor because like I said, my daughter had like juice and everything waste on the floor. So this is a section of the um the dresser which I changed with the dresser out and put on the other side. Okay. In the floor right there you got uh, like little scratches which I don't know. I may need to work on that part right there then where i had the dresser i put like my little table right here my tv yeah yeah if you got a baby in the house okay tell me you can hardly have things organized so this is my little let me turn that chair around this is my little reading spot right here okay but yeah let me tell you this then i put that rock on the floor there just for let me tell you this look at my tv okay do you see that right there i've tried to clean that up so yesterday my daughter just decided to take use my makeup okay you can't really see right now because i got it clean but you can still see like scratches right here where she was just i don't know what she was trying to do but just ugh, i've cleaned that it really can't come out that's what happens when you have a daughter in the house but yeah so you can tell down there like that little piece of wood is still right there which I think I'm going to get somebody to like pull that little piece right there then really get that angle right there fixed. You know what I mean? It don't look it don't look like me right now. Let me just put it that way. So that's something that I need to work on. And yeah, you see that right there by my seat? Yeah. She got nail polish right there. So I just got my shoes and my bags right there. When well, you see any little mark like this, just know that it's my daughter. That's her handwork right there. And on this section right here, that is my closet right there, okay? And let me show you guys a little closer. Can you see that right there? So you see that little piece right there? That's from me cutting the um the carpet. Oh my god, I can't talk right now. From me cutting the carpet, okay? And since I got like stuff inside the closet and I didn't feel like pulling all that out. I left like that entire piece from the closet inside I'm not gonna fool with that okay so that's what it looks like and I literally took all that out without um without lifting this bed you see how the bed is like that that's how the bed stays and I got all the carpets out without touching like I just took like the whole entire um bed mattress off and did like took the carpet under the bed without literally trying to dismount the whole entire bed then ain't nobody got time for that okay so that's what i really wanted to show you guys like during the, during this quarantine period i tried my best to like you know what i mean mm -mm. so i think i did a really good job you know what i mean i did i did and i'm so proud of myself for what i did like looking at the before and the after i think i did a good job and i'm proud of myself so what do you guys think excuse me i think that's a job like just to take the carpet off the floor that would have paid somebody to come do the job you know what i mean but during this quarantine period anybody got time to invite like somebody that you don't know like you know what i mean to come into your house and come do some job in your house with the kids in the house you know what i mean it was something that i had to do myself do it yourself okay i just could not stand like the amount of like water milk juice like have you ever seen like grape juice on your carpet okay i didn't like it at all okay so i had to do something about it so i hope you guys like this video okay and if you like this video 
and you feel like this channel is a channel that you can learn something from please hit on that subscribe button okay and if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and drop a comment down below tell me what you think about my job okay was that good did i do good did i try did i do excellent okay drop a comment down below and let me know but um it's high time we start doing it for ourselves okay save those coins okay you know me when it comes to saving those coins i don't play okay but thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next video